Okay, so if you want videos like this, basically a return to my goon videos, smash the like button. It's 400 likes, and I'll do this again. By the way, if you want to see Merged Sentry versus Death Seed Sentry, let me know in the comment section down below and run up the likes, and I'll do that matchup too, because it's kind of an interesting topic. But anyways, this video, shout out to King. Uh, he DM'd me the other day and said, look, man, I'll make a donation if you make a goon video for a century because people have been disrespecting him ever since Noel took his lunch money. And I said, okay, that's fair. So I'm going to remind the people today of some of the best century moments over the years in terms of quality villainous goon activity. So if you like content like this, again, like, subscribe, all that good stuff, and join the public Discord completely free to join trying to reach 500 asap we're already over 250 so come enjoy the fun but anyways let's get into this so who is sentry right let's let's get it out the way before we celebrate his goon moments who is he robert reynolds was um initially one of the first heroes in marvel technically and he achieved this power through a botched C captain america pseudo experiment where he was injected with a bunch of the supposed cap serum and this gave him the power of quote a million exploding stars but it's a lot crazier than that and um or suns technically and this has allowed for some of the craziest moments in comic history as sentry being that he's literally crazy and split with another being called the void who's like darkness itself um he's had some wild ass moments so let's go over them First of all, let's talk about this. The Void, which is an aspect of himself he regularly has to contend with, especially early on in his runs. Um, it scares the shit out of Hulk. And it actually showed the first time Hulk and Sentry had a run-in and kind of battled. Sentry basically no-deft him. And y'all think Hulk's the strongest there is, so... Sentry's the strongest there is now. Oh my god, oh no. But anyways, moving on. Sentry is referred to, um, particularly in one of his initial runs, as one of the devils of Marvel Comics itself. And he also literally, it starts like recalling comics that were retconned and basically never published because the existence of Sentry was covered up by the Marvel heroes because of how dangerous the Void is. Yet he could recall these comics absurd sentry passively was explained in his earlier runs to have conquered the literal workings of time and space passively so like his cells were sent into a flux where they were constantly ahead in time and this gave him this weird form of existence that allowed reality warping of an absurd level and passively let him overcome the properties of time and space itself which is crazy um, even without using his power in ages, like Sentry was depowered for a long ass time in order to try to keep the void away. Even despite all that time being depowered, he still was willing to scrap the void itself in his underwear. Boy's not even suited up for battle and was like, whatever, bro, we can throw down. And does it end up getting him to kick the shit out of his family dog? Don't worry about it personal problem not yours uh moving on while tripping um after undoing his mind hack that affected all of marvel comics even stan lee um we saw that sentry was quite literally capable of walking through defensive tech designed by reed richards who's gone up against threats like galactus before and all that and this tech passively got folded by sentry Sentry also accidentally undid and folded a mine hacks that impacted all of Marvel Earth, including Thor. Um, so everybody forgot. And like I said, even Stan Lee joked in an interview that he forgot himself. Um, so his ability to neg mine hacks and like the thug life moment in that, literally negging a retcon, uh, retcon and everyone forgetting him, absurd. Um, the Void which bob had bested before uh the short name for century um is considered a threat by reed richards beyond imagination this is crazy because keep in mind 
Literally, Reed has dealt with Galactus. And even compared to that experience, this threat is beyond imagination, which is crazy scaling for the Sentry. Prepped, Doctor Strange literally had no answer for Void. So he saw Void coming and was like, I'm going to be real with you, Sentry. Not shit I can really do. It's up to you. So Sentry has to like be the guy to constantly step up to this threat that even Prep Doctor Strange wants no part of. We also saw that while recovering his abilities and powers, Sentry is capable of casually accessing the mind of Professor X and making him remember shit. Just for comparison, Professor X has literally gone toe to toe with the Phoenix Force and Dark Phoenix before. Um, and held his own in a telepathic battle across all planes of existence and casually gets mind hacked by not even prime sentry absolutely ridiculous spider-man also um, when hanging out with the heroes as they awaited the arrival of void he literally says he thought um that galactus was coming he mistaked the presence of sentry for galactus um, we saw in later runs that Sentry, he's, he's a douchebag in his solo runs. Like he will fade anyone. Like he got pulled up on by a Tuma who gave him this whack ass monologue. And for his troubles, he took the L instantly to Sentry. Sentry's like, I don't got time for this shit. Got him out of there real quick. Terax, arguably this was worse, worse because Terax has, um, a formidable reputation as like a cosmic terrorist and he pulled up on some like environmentalist shit was like oh my god earth and all this they're they're committing all these kind of cosmic global warming shit like that um just weird vibes uh well it was being a tree hugger sentry wasn't vibing with that not only did sentry knock his ass out he folded him in literal seconds and broke his cosmic axe like it was a toy the disrespect is real. He also explained in this run that literally, while he's walking around, combating people, beefing with people, beefing with these galactic to even universal multiversal threats, he's holding back. He's pimp slapping everyone while holding back. Crazy. Hulk um, also got casually one shot by the same void that Sentry would proceed to move on and beat up. And for reference, when I say one shot, literally the Void grabbed Hulk and broke every single bone in his body. And Sentry still said, you can catch this right hand, bitch, uh, and fought him no problem. Um, Sentry versus Void, um, the collision, rivalry, beef, whatever you want to call it. That itself, um, in regards to how Doctor Strange views it, uh, it's viewed as scarier than the cycle of creation itself so life death rebirth all that those cosmic primal forces are not even as scary as the void is century versus void will occur even when time is over so after the concept of time is gone century is going to be throwing hands in the trenches with void still um it, it's it's a crazy power dynamic and something kind of underrated about century the fact that he literally scales to void pretty easily um, in the merged Sentry run uh, that came out in like 2018, Sir, uh, Sentry pre-mergence um, was in his dreamscape and he could dunk on the army of Void and he was even, even like throwing Void through moons. It was absurd and this, this was like to keep him sane and from getting loose in the real world. Uh, Sentry uh, pre-merging also faced villains that are stated to be able to erase ideas themselves sentry then goes on to merge and brings together uh the power of the void and sentry and in case you're wondering he does show off exactly what that looks like merge sentry literally folded a golden sentry tier foe with old sentry's powers and he he was no threat to merge sentry at all merge sentry just bullied him it was it was simple um, in his, quote, old comics that, you know, we never got to see, uh, it's stated anything he does is literally just limited by his mind, what he imagines, what he thinks he can do. Literally, he had 
too much power for absorbing man and it was just too much for absorbing man to absorb and he got bullied and embarrassed this is crazy because this same absorbing man has absorbed power from gods like odin himself and upon trying to absorb sentry he said yo is this what it's like to be god like it, <laughs> like he was like is this god's power like this is ridiculous so that just shows how like thug life the power source of sentry really is uh sentry also tanked being uh, reduced to existence between all forms of matter so basically he was like dispersed and made smaller than all forms of matter throughout existence and was still able to draw power from everywhere at once and at the same time he was able to clap back against an opponent that could disperse all energy at once so it was ridiculous it was just absurd overpowered battle century also speaking of overpowered battles um literally defeated molecule man most famous for going toe to toe with pre retcon beyonder right he wasn't the same level as then or whatnot but that's cool and all but the way he beat molecule man was about as thug life as it gets because he literally beat molecule man in a game of mo molecular manipulation literally out molecule molecule man that's like top 10 most disrespectful things ever in comics and he did that shit pretty casually too uh he also absolutely uh shredded Ares, the god of war in a kind of iconic scene in which he pulled up behind him and just tore him apart uh sentry has also held his own against thor to the point that he has even destroyed thor's own realm or the city of asgard right in front of him and thor couldn't really stop it and finally there's also been accounts of sentry being able to hold his own and even stalemate the mighty Galactus himself with no problem. So there you have it. We have at least 12 minutes of Sentry being an overpowered bully and goon in comics. Uh, if you guys want to see the Death Seed Sentry, who I left off this because he was amped from an outside force and kind of brought back, it just, it's not the same as normal Sentry goon shit. If you want to see that Sentry, that overpowered Death Seed Sentry versus Merge Sentry, run the likes up show love and all that make sure to check out the uh, discord thank you guys so much for watching it's been your boy yfv and i'll see y'all later peace